We got Mark. Sorry, we got Mark here from uh, Science in Motion Sports. He's going to show us the putting analyzer. All right, Mark, take it away. Yeah, this is the Sam Putt Lab. So uh, we've got an ultrasound system here that sends a signal via this triplet through to this basic unit here. We have a software program that analyzes the data, and we can see up to 28 different uh, parameters in the putting stroke. So right now we've got it set for uh, training mode. So that means that after each individual putt, we can have a look at a number of different things that are happening in the stroke. So I'll just do one stroke, uh, hit one putt here, and we can take a look at what happened in that stroke. Okay, so first of all, um, we look at the alignment of the putter face at address. So the address it was on that particular putt was closed 0.3 of a degree. So 0.3 of a degree is going to be well and truly in the hole. One degree is going to be the outside edge of the hole from uh, about 10 feet. So then at impact, the putter face was closed 0.9 of a degree with a stroke path that was 0.4 of a degree to the left. Okay, and we also have uh, the ability to see the, the impact spot. So that was fairly near the center of the face there. Also, we can check the rise angle. So the rise angle is going to help determine the ball roll. So this particular rise angle was 1.2 degrees up, somewhere between 1.5 to, to uh, 4 degrees up would be ideal for the rise angle to give the best possible roll. And then we can also look at the rotation of the face. So um, the face uh, is going to open and close a little in relation to the target line. So we, we get a, uh, a rating of 89% of uh, percent that particular part there. And then we can see the face on path. So we want the face to be square to the path as much as possible. So a, a black reading here is square to the path. If, we, if it showed up as red in that color code, it would be open in relation to the path, or blue would be closed. Okay, and then we can also see the, the, uh, the rhythm and the timing. So um, yeah, that, that backswing, left, backswing timing, time to impact, and forward swing time was all pretty good there. And then we can, uh, when we do a, uh, a measurement, and usually a measurement and analysis of a player, it's five butts, and we bring up a number of different reports, which can then be emailed or printed out and given to the customer. So uh, we usually then recommend uh, a course of action to improve the putting stroke. Then we can reassess after a month or so, and then uh, do the same thing again. Just keep checking and measuring, and and uh, deciding on uh, you know how to improve the stroke, and and you know people can then improve. Cool, very very cool. And how do you calibrate? We kind of saw a little bit of a calibration. Okay, so the calibration is basically that uh, this arm here comes out from this unit, the receiving unit. We've we've already uh, ensured that it was. It was uh, aligned properly via a, a little laser unit that goes here, and then we just butt the face up against that, uh, this arm here, and then we know that we've got the putter face aligned squarely at address. And Excellent. then we can just remove that arm and we're ready to go. Perfect. Well, thank you very much, Mark. This is a very You're cool welcome. putting analyzer, and uh, we'll let everybody know about it right away. Okay. All right. Great.